Hello, Hello happy guys. guys! Welcome to our channel and today we're going to have Spriggan Evolution Line! Yeah, so we have here all the Spriggan Evolutions from Beyblade Burst. So we will discuss each and every Beyblade from the single layer system up to the latest DB layer system. Yeah. Yes, we will also have test battles against other Beyblades. Yeah, so, yes, yes, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, so let's go! Let's go! The first Spriggan Baby is Spriggan Spread Fusion. It was released by Takara Tomy on July 18, 2015 as a part of the Burst system. It is a pre anime Spriggan Baby. The layer, Spriggan, is a right spin balance type layer. It has both aggressive shape and defensive aspect. It features three prominent bombs on each side of it. Two of them getting your shape from the double clone like design created by the colored plastic underneath its spread casing. That's really cool. Okay, so next we have the Forge Disc Spread. It's a completely circular for Forge Disc. It, it, is re it was very useful in stamina combinations due to its weight distribution and its fair weight. Nice! Okay, next Driver Fusion. And it features a plastic flat tip with a small diameter and a protrusion in its center. When launched, Fusion will spin on the top protrusion creating a stable stamina con converting spin. Cool! Okay, so let's build it. Okay. So the spring and layer, the spread disc, and the fusion driver. There. It's cool that the baby looks here in the middle. Oh, yeah, it's nice. So we there you have it guys, our spring and spread fusion. Yeah. Our first spring and baby. So next we have Storm Spriggan Local Unite. It is a balanced type Beyblade released by Terakatomi as part of the dual layer system on April 2nd, 2016. We have the layer Storm Spriggan, a right spin balanced type dual layer that combines offensive and defense with, with its two upper heavy attack plates and its two lower defense plates. So next is the Forge Disc. Knuckle. It is, it, it is a circular forge disc with six notches are around the perimeter and four holes near the center of the forge disc that gives it an excellent stamina properties. So the next driver that is Unite. It features a flat rubber tip with a sharp plastic tip in the center. When launched straight down into the stadium, the sharp tip in the center will keep the Beyblade stable and still in the center, preventing stamina loss. Nice! Okay, so let's build it. Storm spray gun. Knuckle and the night driver. There. Nice. Nice. Okay, so this is our second spring and baby. Okay, so we have here our third spring and baby. We have Legend Spring and Seven Merge. It is a balanced type baby released by Takara Tommy as part of the God Layer system on July 1st, 2017. The layer, Legend Spring and is a dual spin balance type god layer with four large blades and a built-in metal god chip in the center. This can deliver a strong attack when rotating clockwise and a smash attack when rotating counterclockwise. So we have Forge Disc 7. Okay. That's an ideal weight distribution for stamina combinations. Then we have the driver, Merge. It features a six-pointed flat rubber tip with a sharp plastic tip in the center. When new, it creates an aggressive movement pattern and if it's worn, worn down, however, instead of creating aggressive movement when struck, the rubber will instead act as a brakes against a knockout at the cost of stamina before going back to stable from the sharp center. Nice! Yeah! Let's build it! Let's build on 7 merge. Yeah! It looks so cool! Gigantic axe! <laughs> Okay, so our fourth spring and Beyblade is Spring and Requiem Zero Zeta. It is a balanced type Beyblade released by Takara Tomy as part of the God Layer system on December 28, 2017. We have the layer here, Spring and Requiem. It's a dual spin layer that has a built-in metal god chip. It also has a rotation absorption ability due to its rubber parts. Okay, then we have our Forge Disc Zero. The Forge Disc Zero is one of the heaviest Forge Discs during its time and it has a high stamina potential. Then we have the driver, Zeta, which features an adjustable tip as at a standard height with three settings, attack, defense, and stamina. So there, we can adjust it. Cool. Yeah. So let's put it. So we have here, Spriggan, Requiem, Zero Zeta. Okay, 
so next we have Josie Spriggan 01 Zeta Dash. So it is a balanced type Beyblade released by Takara Tommy as part of the Josie layer system on November 17, 2018 with the Josie customized set. So we have here the layer Josie Spriggan. So it is a balanced type Josie layer that can be switched between spin directions and can attack the opponent with no damage and is equipped with an invisible mode that keeps the Beyblade from bursting when launched with a powerful force. Then we have the disc zero one there. So this disc frame combination is one of the heaviest combination during its time and has a high attack potential. Then we have the driver. So we have the Zeta Dash. So this is the upgraded version of Zeta. So again, it, is, it has an adjustable tip with three settings, attack, defense, and stamina. So this upgraded version features a much thicker spring in its lock mechanism, so that increases the burst resistance of the Zeta Drag. So that's Zeta Dash. Okay, nice. Yay, yeah, let's do it. Do it. So this is Josie's Freedom yeah. Zero Wall Zeta Dash. Nice. That's so cool. Let's go. Okay, so we have here Lord's Freedom Blitz Dimension Dash. So, Lord Spriggan Blitz Dimension Dash is a balanced type Beyblade released as part of the Gatinko layer system on August 10, 2019. So, this is part of the GT Triple Booster set. So, Lord Spriggan is the only Spriggan Beyblade not to be featured in the Burst anime. So, this is not an official evolution of Spriggan in the anime. So, we have here the layer. So, it has the Spriggan Gatinko chip. So this is a balanced type Gatinko chip that supports both left and right rotation. The Layer Lord is a balanced type base that can be switched between left and right rotation and has both attack power and rotation absorption capacity with its large rubber blades. Then we have the disc. The disc is Blitz, which is an attack type disc that attacks the opponent with a powerful blow with three blades popping out when the rotational force is high. Then we have the driver. So we have the Dimension Dash. So again, this is an upgrade from the original Dimension Driver. So it is a balanced type driver that has three different height adjustment. So you can adjust it in low, middle, and the highest. Nice. Okay, so let's build it. Yes, build it. So that's Lord Spriggan Blitz Dimension Dash. Yeah. 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 So right. Yeah. So cool. Okay. okay, so our next Beyblade is World Spriggan Unite Dash 2B. So it is a balanced type Beyblade released by Takara Tommy as part of the Super Kick layer system on September 19, 2020. So this is the evolution of the Josie Spriggan Zero Wall Zeta Dash. So we have here the layer and the Super King Chip Spriggan. So, okay, so this can be transformed and attached to either a left or right spin ring. So we have the ring. World Ring, a dual spin balance type ring equipped with a burst lock that can spin in either left or right rotation by turning it over and does not burst when it receives a stronger impact. Then we have the chassis, 2B. So this chassis is a balance type double chassis that can switch between a fixed and attack mode. So it has a free rotating defense mode with the ring. Ooh. Then we have the driver. So the driver is Unite Dash. So Unite Dash features a flat rubber tip with a sharp plastic tip in the center that sits at the standard height. When launched straight down into the stadium, the sharp tip in the center will keep the Beyblade stable and still in the center, preventing stamina loss. Unlike the other Dash drivers, Unite Dash features a stronger spring lock increasing the performance tip's burst resistance. Okay, so now let's build it. So first, we have it in right right spin. Here is World Spriggan Unite Dash 2B in its right right spin mode. Yes, it's in free spin also. Okay, so now let's switch it. Switch it. Right spin. So we just need to turn it over, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So this mode, the layer has the ring has the black accent. Yeah. So here is World Spriggan 
You like dash 2D in left spin mode. Yeah. Nice color. Okay, so there you have it. We're just pretty done. Okay, so now we have here our latest spray gun Beyblade. We have Astral Spray Gun Over Quattro Zero. So this is a balanced type Beyblade, released as part of the Astral Spray Gun Cosmite set of the Dynamite Battle Layer System. So this is initially released on August 7, 2021. So we have our DB Core Spray Gun. So this is a dual spin DB Core that can switch between spin directions using a dedicated tool. So we have here our tool. So if you want to switch, just drag it over and use the tool to switch it from left to right. There. Next, we have the blade Astra. Okay, so we have here the Astra blade. It is also a dual spin balance type blade that can spin still with its rubber parts when in left spin and make powerful attacks with its metal parts when it's in right spin. Yes. Then it comes with the zero armor and the overforged disc. So the over is a round DB disc and one of the heaviest forged discs with an ideal weight distribution for any combination. Then we have the driver. So this is the, one of the coolest driver in the DB system. We have the Quattro driver. So this is a balance type driver that can switch between four tip modes according to your preference. So it has two types of metal tips, stamina and defense type, and two types of rubber tips, the attack type and the balance type. So, this is how you switch modes. Cool. Okay, so let's build Astral Spriggan over Quattro Zero Armor. Okay. So the TV big this, you can build them in high mode or low mode. So we are building it now in low, low mode. mode. Astral Spree Gun in its left spin mode. Yeah. So that's low mode, right? Yeah. So let's try in high mode. Left spin. So you can easily switch it for to high mode. So the place to sink off the armor here is crucial. So you should put it on top like that. Then the DB core. In high mode. Yeah. It's cooler in low mode. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Then let's have it in right spin mode. Let's see. So this is where you'll be needing the tool to change the mode. Okay. There. Make sure you put it in the right. Spriggan, right spin, high mode. Okay, let's go as well. Okay, so there you have it. Our Astro Spriggan over Quattro Zero. Whoa. Okay, so now let's do the test battle. Let's, let's go! Let's go!
Okay, so there you have it guys, our Sprigan Evolution Line! We hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe. Bye!